Okay, I'll have a pair of gloves, and we're going to just get her to animate a little bit here. And I've done some drawings on the face. I'll, I'll mark those out. I'll show you what I've done with those uh, markings. This was that was more for the filler, and the um, and the areas I'm going to treat with energy-based devices. So now this is a BND needle, 31 gauge. Okay, it's not 30 units, so it's an insulin needle, but it's not 30 units because I dilute my Botox and my my Javeau, and those are pretty much the only one-to-one -one equivalents. And then I go right down to the sub-Q, because I want to avoid frontalis. I want to go under frontalis. I go right down to the hub of the needle, and I go from 30 down to 20. That's not 10. That's 5 units, because it's 2 to 1 dilution. 20 down to 10. That's not 10 units. That's, five. that's, that's not 10 units. That's 5. And from 10 down to 0, that's not 10 units. That's 5. So I went from 30 to 0. That's not 30 units. That's 15. And I use f units of five almost everywhere. I happen to use a lot in the depressor corrugator supercilia because it's very important. So knock the thing off. Okay, so we're going to use the Accutite. Let's take, let's take a look at the Accutite, what it looks like. This little cannula is smaller than the 22 gauge I was just using. Now, the other option alone or in combination is to take your Morpheus body or your Morpheus face and provide external radio frequency undermining a coagulation. Very fast, works very quickly. And same on this side. Okay, last but not least is our injection suture suspension. Think what we've done. We have undermined this whole tissue. We did the Accutite, we did the face tight, and the uh, tight under the neck. Now if we were to slide that skin over the deeper tissue and hold it, after the suture's gone 24 weeks from now, collagen will hold that lift in place, and that's our goal. A suture suspension craniofacial lift holding our injection RF skin tightening. Look at her jawline. Look how tight that is now, and that's going to be held until she heals. Now we've gone from bizygomatic dominant where we were bijowl dominant, and now the jowl and the jawline is tight, and we've created bizygomatic dominance. Okay, so she's a bit puffy and weird. That's what we'd expect. Um, but remember what we did. She got full face um, Morpheus, full face IPL. We did the Forma. Uh, we then did a um, Accutite Morpheus aggressive lower jawline and neck. Uh, and then we did our suture suspension. She had six or seven syringes and 100 units. That would be sort of uh, post-op Tordal, no narcotic needed. A couple of days of cavazolin, clindamycin if she's pen allergic, and that's it.